I wonder what else is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. But... Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Thanks for the heads up. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hills, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. None of that matters now. The only thing that does is stopping ours. The city needs you now more than ever. <sighs> I'll, uh... Leave you to it, then. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the back... Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. <laughs> Harvey needs to get out of there. Hey, Bruce. Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's... Well, it's, it's not exactly pleasant. Harvey, listen to me. Stay away from the debate. What? No, Bruce, I I'm already here. Kinda crazy. Security's on high alert because of this threat from some guy named Penguin. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of a kill, if you ask me. Uh... Look, Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but my advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Until all this mess with your family blows over. They're afraid it's not a... I, I get it, it's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public, but you and me, we'll know the truth about our friendship. No matter what, we need a new mayor. Hill needs to be removed. I, I knew you'd see it that way. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we wanted. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> I guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember, you are always my friend. Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. Just so we're clear, 
You and me, we're on shaky ground. Jim, listen. No, listen to me. The excessive violence, it, it can't go on. Most of the GCPD already think you're a monster. Don't prove them right. You're lucky I'm on your side. That may be true, but I can't ally with a violent thug. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? We're all on the same side, Jim. Well, this better not come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, come in. That, um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. Doing the right thing? Maybe there's hope for you yet. Don't read too much into it. I'm just allergic to owing you anything. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha! Do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? Now you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. We are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates, incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hill and the challenger, Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. And it's also important for you, the citizens of Gotham, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a city that's faced its share of hardships in recent years. Rising crime rates, income inequality, yes, a massive vigilante loose on our streets. At least we know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. Oh, those goddamn so sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First order of business... Firing the moderator! I hate to be a downer, but these hostages... I don't like their chances. Oh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. If we're quick and decisive, no one else has to die. If you say so. But Penguin's playing for keeps. Fanatics always do. <gasps> You'll do. Get out here. Keep it quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. You. Oh, Thank you wait. for volunteering. Please. No. Go on, then. Introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right. I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Gotta take them out quietly. The, the 
subject on everyone's mind is the new Wayne Mental Health Facility. It's, it's a much needed state of the art mental health care hospital that will offer treatment to the most unfortunate of God citizens. <laughs> I told you all the truth! Look at still old Missy's rubbish! We had a deal. I gave it to you. Save me! Get up! Oh, one! Oh, oh. Oh. As I talk, shut your gun when I say shut your gun! Easy! Rule two! That's it, boy! You're kicking it! Oh, all this courage! Rule three! Always, always tell me. Even if it hurts, it will hurt worse if you don't. Maybe next time. Keep your heads down. Make for the police line. And now, a word from our sponsor. My townsmen, brothers and sisters of color, you have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. We are here to end the masquerade and expose the corruption that ruined your city. For too long, men like your esteemed mayor have profited from the pain of innocence. This is spiraling out of control. They have no idea about the man behind the mask. Whoever it is, they're smart. Let someone else get their hands dirty. Look into the hearts of these spineless creatures. Go on, love. You know what to do. Ah! Candidates, take off your masks. Saw that moderator get shot on live TV. What's going on in there? First off, we should incinerate the pool. Batman! 
You certainly know how to make an entrance. Go! <laughs> Why don't you kick the crap out of here? Stop! I had him killed because of it! Get away from me back, my poor old mum! So this is for her. Not that you kill anyone else! Why, your turn, Dent! Your mate, Bruce Wayne, your biggest supporter, and he didn't even turn up. <laughs> Batman! The revolution's already started! It's too late to join! I'm not here to join you. I'm here to crush you. That's what I was afraid of. City Hall is in chaos after Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. He won't be the same after this. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public.
representing Bruce Wayne, have no comment at this time. We are the children of Arkham, and we have opened your eyes. Next time on Batman, the Telltale series. You may have saved me, but this isn't over. You don't know these people, Bruce. Authorities are scrambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy, but there's still no sign of their masked leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is, Who's next? After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham, sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now... they want to decide what your future at this company will be. Do you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting? What do you want from me? You know what I want. No more hiding, but for anyone. But don't worry, Bruce Wayne's finally gonna get what's coming to him. Bruce! Bruce!